Today I am talking about the chemical properties of hydrogen. What are the important chemical properties? There are many properties but among them very important are taken. First, we can say that hydrogen bonds in air. Number one, you remember that bonding. Hydrogen bonds in air and it reacts with oxygen to form water. In bonding is the process of what? Formation of water also we can say. Hydrogen when bonds in oxygen, it forms water. The oxygen to oxygen to. This is one of the important chemical property of hydrogen. Now, second, let's talk about another one. Second, what can we say? Sodium, potassium, calcium, etc. This metal reacts with hydrogen. This um, re metal reacts with hydrogen. Now, how to remember this? Reaction with metal. Reaction with metal. One is sodium, another is potassium, and another one, calcium. We can say magnesium also. They react with hydrogen on heating and they react with hydrogen to form hydrides they react with hydrogen to form hydride sodium hydride valency of sodium hydrogen both one and that's why no exchange potassium hydride and in the same way calcium hydride calcium valency two hydrogen valency one that's why cas2 now how to balance this equation this is hydrogen here it is 2 and we have to take here 2 hydrogen it is 2 here that's why take here 2 this way this is the reaction with metal now we can say another property like this when hydrogen gas is passed over hot metallic oxide like copper oxide lead oxide zinc oxide iron oxide then what happens these metallic oxides are reduced to metal thus metal is separated now how can we uh, write this chemical reaction we have to remember the reaction this way uh, this is the reaction with metallic oxide reaction with metal oxide you remember this way and the reaction exactly reaction is what hydrogen is when passed over copper oxide heated copper oxide then what happens then copper is separated with the formation of water in the same way if hydrogen gas is passed over lead oxide then lead is separated This way we can give the example. This okay, this can be balanced. This is balanced equation. That's why we don't have to balance. Okay. Now next number four. When hydrogen reacts with halogens, reaction with halogen. Remember this reaction with halogen. Reaction with halogen. When hydrogen reacts with halogen means uh, the elements which lies in group 7 of periodic table fluorine, chlorine, bromine, iodine, etc. When hydrogen reacts with them, hydrogen if reacts with let's say chlorine, hydrogen when reacts with let's say bromine, then what happens? It forms halides. This hydrogen chloride, and here it is hydrogen bromide combination of hydrogen we can balance this way okay now there is another uh, ke chemical property one of the important chemical property number five what can we see this is a uh, Haber process we have to remember this way Haber process this is a process of uh, making ammonia in this process nitrogen reacts with hydrogen but for this this is not simple reaction for this 
actually 500 degree celsius temperature is necessary and at least 200 atmosphere pressure atmosphere pressure is necessary and uh, for this iron is used as catalyst and molybdenum is used as promoter and under all these conditions nitrogen combines with hydrogen to form ammonia and this can be balanced this way two and two three is six and nitrogen two okay this process is called Haber process uh, and by this process ammonia is prepared and which is later used uh, in the preparation of fertilizer now let's talk about another property now number six reaction with we can remember this way reaction with non-metal with non-metal it reacts with non-metals at high temperature carbon is non-metal when it reacts with hydrogen at very high temperature then it forms methane and for this we can balance this way in the same way uh, this sulfur also reacts with hydrogen at very high temperature to form this hydrogen sulfide gas this way these are some important chemical properties of hydrogen we can remember um, with the help of these headings burning reaction with metal reaction with metal uh, metallic oxide reaction with halogens rea uh, Haber process reaction with non-metal etc okay this much for today